foreign tourists that perform unrespectful behavior during their holiday in Indonesia, including in the country's top tourist destination, the island of Gats, Bali, has sparked controversy. And how do the people of Indonesia see this kind of negative behavior from foreign tourists? Joining us tonight on Asia Prime, Nilo Jalantik, a Balinese social rights activist who is also an entrepreneur. Mbok Nilo, thank you for joining good us. Evening. Yes, good evening, Ibal. Uh, nice meeting you here. Thank all you right. so much for the opportunity. Hope all's good there. Uh, Mbok Nilo, do you still receive reports concerning bad behavior from foreigners? Yes, actually on daily basis we, we receive up to hundreds of uh, reports and also uh, uh, requests for, for help from, uh, from either local and also from foreigners uh, themselves. And, uh, and this, uh, this has become my, my, uh, my struggle because uh, hmm. for, already for a few years I've been reminding the, the government that uh, we actually have a, a reason that we actually have all the right to choose what kind of uh, tourism that that we would like to to receive, and uh, I, I've been talking about the very same thing for the last 12 years. And today we are facing with the reality that uh, if we uh, if we did what we have uh, uh, that we, we we have to do in, uh, in 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 2010 and 2011, and and, and creating Bali and Indonesia as a tourism destination with. Uh, uh, that we that uh, how do you call it that uh, that put quality uh, offer uh, offer quantity uh, in terms of uh, uh, what kind of uh, customer or what kind of uh, tourist that we would like to have we 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 didn't we don't have to sit down right here now uh, Iqbal mm. I don't have to to tell you all any kind of problems that we are facing today and 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 and, and, and then. And we are very grateful. We are very grateful that with the assistance of uh, immigration uh, uh, chief and also uh, the assistance of the uh, poli, uh, the Indonesian uh, police, and also uh, from the minister of tourism. But at, at the at the end of the day, there is always uh, the same message that I always have to pass every time: mm. a regulation, mm. the regulation, very basic regulation that we have to apply from the day the tourists arrive in the airport this okay. is not to be to be how do you call it this is not something to be to be bargained for you know this is not something hmm. to be to be to be discussed uh, again and again and again you just make this regulation you sit down with with all the institution uh, involved and you apply that as soon as they arrive so there's no there's no more like okay we're going to uh, give them as uh, exception this time okay they don't understand about the law okay maybe they don't, they don't have any any information uh, how to behave uh, behave accordingly in indonesia no they know it already this mm, would be their okay. so Mok Nilo, are you saying that uh, the regulation itself or the law enforcement the enforcement of regulations uh, the law in, uh, uh, you know the police cannot cannot uh, cannot perform the law enforcement if the if, if the the foreigners didn't didn't uh, didn't uh, didn't do any criminal act mm. and the immigration cannot cannot perform the law enforcement if the tourists uh, didn't uh, didn't break the rules in terms of mm. uh, in terms of their stay uh, permit so for me they can only uh, they can only perform law enforcement after receiving the report that okay. staff foreigner uh, perform a, a work or job or run business, and the police can 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 only perform the the, the, the action uh, after receiving the report that this foreigner uh, stealing something or, or doing uh, criminals uh, criminals things in in, in Indonesia. Hmm. But for me, the, the the bigger homework is on Minister of Tourism. Hmm. The bigger homework is on the people who actually on the on the institution that actually opening the door to tourism. Mm. And we cannot we cannot do it, uh, you know, alone. Uh, the police cannot work alone. Immigration cannot work alone, and also Ministry of Tourism cannot work alone. So we, they have to work hand in hand along also with the tax uh, tax department to ensure that Indonesia uh, can become uh, uh, like a safe country for the people and also for for the real uh, expat or, or tourists or foreigners who who plan and and willing mm. to <coughs> Indonesia. But at the end, of, but at the beginning, they need to know that there is a, a rules to be respected. You know, you cannot just come to Indonesia and pretending that you don't know anything. No, no, no. Yeah, this is, yeah. this, <coughs> and, this uh, is a test. You know? 
uh, uh, there's a controversy on uh, recently the Indonesian public were uh, sparked an anger about the report on the rooster sounds and also the mot motorbike plat and stuff like that. What kind of problems actually were reported to your platform, Lapor Nilu? And when did it all started actually, Mot Nilu? Uh, my, 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 my intention is, is very simple, Iqbal. My intention is for everybody to respect and follow the rules. Hmm. We as a nation, we run our small company, we pay our taxes, we apply all the, docu the documentation that have to be that have to be applied, and we respect all the rules. Simply because we love this country, simply mm. because we, we want to to give back to this country. And when somebody as a guest come to this country and then take take so much uh, advantage of uh, of a place that I call home, a place where I was born, a place of of uh, 270 million people were born, I don't take that lightly. You know, I don't take that lightly because. As I said, Bali is not your home. Bali mm. is a place that gives you home. So respect the rules, respect the people, respect our tradition. As uh, as uh, the same uh, as uh, also the you need to respect the, the our country regulation. And if you don't if you don't want to do that, then there will be a law enforcement. You know. So mm. like for example, exchanging the the the, the plat number. Mm. At some point, maybe some people think it's cool. At some point, people think, oh yeah, Mbak Nilo. Don't you think it's a little bit too harsh because you are like uh, kind of like judging the foreigners for doing for changing that? Why don't you impose also the same law to the people who make who actually made the plat? And mm. how am I supposed to know if those people who made the plat uh, local people? How how the local people were supposed to know that they are they are creating the plats for for such uh, for this bike or that bike? So mm. they as a foreigners they come from the country. Who, are, who is uh, that, that, that is more advanced than our country? They should come here and give us an example, you know. Mm, they should okay. come here and 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 and, and, and tell us a, a, a tale or story about their country, you know. I mean, they should be grateful to be able to come to Indonesia that we welcome them with our open door and our, our open heart, but don't take it for granted. And mm. and, and 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 then and you know and and also for the for the rooster thing, I mean. <laughs> Excuse me, you know that you know that you are in Indonesia. You know that you're gonna have to deal with ceremony, hmm. uh, with music, with dance performance, with with people uh, chatting on your left and on your right uh, uh, neighborhood, and also with the roosters. Roosters part hmm. of our life, life uh, you know, uh, our life every day, you know. Yeah. And, and this is Rooster something. Rooster knows nothing. <laughs> Rooster knows <laughs> nothing. They cannot go to court, and, and then... they cannot police and say we are going to feel also uh, you know we're going to feel also a petition and we would mm. like to pass a uh, bonding you know like uh, we also yeah. would like you know and then not do <laughs> and then, but Nilo, I want. Uh, there's an interesting perspective because you know there's uh, a lot of complaints before that uh, it's related with the foreign privileges that foreign tourists get. They're uh, they're treated. Uh, more special compared to do, the, the domestic tourists, for example. Do you think there's a relation there? Uh, I've been receiving lots of complaints from uh, from uh, our uh, our Indonesian uh, kesayangan. I call them kesayangan. Hmm. I don't call them follower or uh, tourists or or uh, you know like uh, fans or something like uh, or anything like that. I always call them kesayangan. At the beginning of pandemic, I invite I invited everyone everyone all the indonesian people i i told them please come please come home please come home please visit us in bali we need you more than ever uh, our bali is waiting for you why why should i why should i do that i don't i don't run any business in in hospitality i mm. didn't have any, uh, any homestay or hotels or or nor i i have like transport company i'm nilo jelantik we are a shoemaker we simply can send our shoes anywhere in the world without any customer coming to our island. But why do I? Why did I have to do the, the things that I have to do? Because I simply love and care that for my for my for my for for, for the island where, where where I was born and 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 
and then it comes with with uh, with uh, you know with uh, with consequences because in the past we have treated uh, local uh, or domestic uh, tourism not in the same way uh, where we treated the, the foreigners tourists for example i mean it does apply in certain places it didn't apply in 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 all uh, in all venue probably it happened in one beach club or in one hotels chain and 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 some restaurants but that day i told everyone hmm. step my apology i'm really sorry let let us make it up to you i will make it better for you this time and i really really mean it from the from the deepest part of my heart and i really hope that the Balinese people understand what i'm fighting for that we cannot play with our services be it indonesian mm. tourism be it foreigner or or uh, overseas tourism we need to treat them all equal equal and, <clears throat> and 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 then you know and then like for example today when we receive uh, so many problems uh, created by by the by the by the how you call it, by the foreigners by the illegal uh, uh, foreign uh, workers who live and make a living in bali run their companies in bali we get so much support we get such a massive support from all over the country from abroad from all indonesia that their nationalism is back they were like come on bonilu we are with you you are not alone you know mm. you have all support and they were like and they and they proved that with thousands and thousands of comments in every uh, uh, and in every situation that i i have to let everybody knows mm. and that sounds mm. harsh because maybe it seems that i'm 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 i'm, I'm very tough on, on 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 foreigners and i'm very soft and and more uh, and so much love to to our uh, local uh, you know local uh, local uh, local uh, local uh, tourism but this is not the case the case is if we have an indonesian fellow come to bali or uh, run a company in bali uh, do their job in bali they will have satpol pp they will have police officer they will have tax office if they don't do their business properly if they do some uh, some uh, some criminal act for example they will have their local people deal with it mm. what about the trainers mm. how we going to deal with them mm-hmm. you know we cannot yeah. touch them they don't do any crime but the police cannot touch them uh, if they, did, they didn't break the law the immigration cannot touch them uh, because on the passport is still written that that they are on for example visiting visa uh, visa and then there's no proof that uh, they, they, they are doing uh, actually performing a job so the most important is for this institution to work hand in hand together okay <clears throat> to keep us all at peace at the end of the day you know all i can tell you one day is only a good news Iqbal, you know that a synergy that after after and a good synergy for indonesia and, yep. and and everyone you know like and then this this good news can be can be passed to all over the world you know because mm. we are just trying to protect our right we are just trying to 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 tell everyone that we have a dignity to protect we okay. have our, you know and 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 this is something that that uh, that you know that nobody can can blame us for doing it you know okay okay uh, a synergy that's all we need uh, among the institutions the last one uh mbok nilo we heard a lot of um locals that says they lost their job over foreigners that just comes but because uh, the foreigners owned the business they uh they own the business and then uh on the contrary indonesian tourism ministry is tried to boost tourism by inviting as much as foreign tourists come here to indonesia so what should be prioritized so locals still can keep their jobs but at on the other side the foreign tourists still enjoy bali according to regulation you know when there is no local who can still keep their job there will be nobody there will be no indonesia so as much as you love tourism you need to protect your own people first people come first if there is no people who take care of you in in the hotel rooms in your ballroom in your reception room forget about those foreigners you know mm. at, the end the, at the end of the day bali will be gone and we don't want bali to be gone you know we have to protect our island at any cost even even though if i have to face if i have to fight against everyone i i, I don't have any hesitation to do that as long as I, as long as i'm doing it in uh, you know in 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 the 
uh, with you know with by by still by respecting the law and like for example like i mean how can you imagine bali we are in bali we've been doing massage for example or we have be, we've been doing uh, the therapist uh, job for example or like uh, painting your nail or like uh, uh, you know like a surf instructor surf yeah and and now that job has been taken away by foreigners hmm. i mean i i need to know if the country really care about indonesian about its people they need to make a proper rule what kind of job can be done and what kind of job cannot be done by foreigners if the job is so difficult like for example if the job cannot be done by indonesian for example we cannot invent uh, like uh, like for example a proper phone okay mm. of course you will you will open just an investment company to make a proper phone for example mm. but everybody can you know everybody everybody can can do the like the labor job like the very basic job such as Uh, you know, such as uh, doing the customer service to a customer. I mean, okay. this kind of job should not be taken away. And and in Bali, there are so many job uh, field that has been taken away. Even you will find uh, an, a foreigner who can teach you how to ride a bike. You can find a foreigner who will simply take your picture for a hundred bucks. Mm. You can find a foreigner who can actually, you know, become okay. your. Uh, you know what I mean? So. Yeah. I don't take it lightly, and I really need the government to take uh, to take action to to you know. I mean, I don't talk about big businesses or big investment uh, in terms of uh, uh, manufacturing uh, such a thing. I'm talking about our tiny island with 4.5 million people that okay. we have 4.5 million people to protect. Okay. So, mm. as a rabbit, for example, you don't give us a wolf without any protection. Okay. You know, and and. Because sooner or later, Bali people will will start. You know, we 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 will. You know, we will be hand in hand and and, and working together and make our okay. voice together and we make sure our voice is heard. That's Thank the, you. the most important message there, Bo Nilo. Our time is short, but your struggling is long with kesayangan. <laughs> Thank you for joining us tonight so much, on Asia Prime. So Once again. Thank you.